Back to the charts of Big Boss Crypto, and today we once again take a look at Chainlink and why Sergey Nazarov, the CEO of Chainlink, is most possibly Satoshi Nakamoto, the creator of Bitcoin. We'll look at an interesting news article right here, and also further proof that might suggest that Sergey actually is Satoshi, and why Chainlink is the next big evolution in crypto and for the world overall, from Bitcoin to Chainlink as a new standard. And also why the bit most big uh, financial elite people that has the most power, like Klaus Schwab and Eric Schmidt themselves, know the truth and want to scale Chainlink to become the number one coin in the crypto space. So without further ado, let's look at the charts. Okay, so on the screen right here, we've got a news article from news.bitcoin.com. So... Basically, if you want to read that by yourself, I'll provide a link in the description. But we'll scroll down to a super interesting segment right here, which is the highlight of the article. Uh, further, further down, right here. Uh, you can see right here, this is a screenshot of a piece of source code for Bitcoin. And in June 2020, the financial reporter Mikhail Kapelkov discovered that the first version of Bitcoin contained a Russian proxy. And as you can see right here in this uh, red mark, marker right here, uh, basically this... Uh, piece of uh, gibberish numbers is basically, if you decode that, uh, you get an IP address that is basically tied to Sergey Nazarov historically when he made previous uh, foil posts around the internet all the way back before 2008. And also to further proof as to why Sergey Satoshi is when he registered his domain for smartcontract.com, which was the previous name for Chainlink, all the way back in 2008, the 25th of October. And what happened in 2008? A lot, actually. The great financial crisis and also the creation of Bitcoin, which, funny enough, uh, a spear coincidence was exactly a week later on 31st of October 2008. So if you believe coincidence is good for you, but there are very few of these these days. And yeah, basically exactly one week after uh, uh, Sergey registered his domain, Bitcoin was created. Which is funny enough, as basically the purpose of smartcontract.com or Chainlink today is to bridge the gap, as you can see right here, between real world, real world data, any type of blockchains, and real world events, which is basically the outside world. So this is funny enough that Sergey had this vision all the way back in 2008 and wanted to basically create his first big crypto project to create basically the blockchain technology and basically the birth of Bitcoin. So this strongly suggests that Sergey actually is Satoshi. Uh, looking further down in this interesting blog post right here, we can see that Sergey needed an organic, organic community to build a test model, which was Bitcoin, to basically introduce blockchain technology to the world, so that the improved blockchain, which was Ethereum, could be utilized to launch his decentralized oracle, so that the technology could basically catch up People develop it further so that Chainlink's ultimate vision might be possible in the future. And that the smart contracts was the main focus from day one for uh, Sergey. And funny enough, uh, right here, that Chainlink will make Bitcoin look like an after school lemonade stand, which is true when you look at Chainlink's ultimate vision. And that all future systems will be monitored and executed by Chainlink's technology. It's comfy knowing that they will already made it in the future. Well said. And you have to understand with Sergey is basically that he's a deeply philosophical person and basically wants to build Chainlink as basically powering the whole world and creating the infrastructure that makes the world a more fair place. As you can see right here with this infographic showing it perfectly, how Chainlink bridges the gap between various blockchains, the real world data and the real world events. And also that he wants to create a world with more with cryptographic truth basically guaranteed with mathematics and basically raw data instead of like just tr trust us paper promises that we unfortunately seen, especially in the crypto space with SPF, the FTX scandal and Terra Luna, Luna Classic. And also that he wants to build Chainlink to become a global standard for cryptographic truth as well. And this is why the big financial elite and global elite people like the World Economic Forum, Klaus Schwab, loves Chainlink actually, and has written about Chainlink many times in his book, uh, Shaping the Future of the Fourth Industrial Revolution, 
And if you want to learn more about Klaus Schwab and how he steeply evolved into Chainlink, we'll provide a link to that video on top of the screen right here. And not only that, we also got top, top global industry leaders like Eric Schmidt. And if you don't know who that is, he's basically, he basically is the guy who scaled Google to where it is today so that it's, it is the global behemoth of the powers the world. And you want that kind of people to be involved in Chainlink and helping Sergey to make Chainlink become the ultimate vision of the future of basically powering everything we do. So as the guy right here said in uh, this uh, interesting blog post right here, all the way back in 2018, he basically saw it coming. It's comfy. It's very comfortable knowing that we have already made it in the future, which I truly, truly believe that we all Chainlink holders will do. That's all for me. Thanks so much for your time. Leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video or leave a dislike if you didn't. I hope everyone has had a wonderful, happy new year. And remember that this is not financial or investment advice. It's only for educational and entertainment purposes only. This is Big Boss Crypto, the realest of the real of crypto YouTubers. Have a wonderful day, everyone. Big Boss out.